Today we're going to show you one of the best ways to beat man coverage out of the trip side information of Madden 24. And we're going to be taking a look at the play curl flat. Now this is in the Patriots playbook. It's also in the Packers playbook. If you want to learn how I run trip side in, join the Patreon. It's only 10 bucks. Got a full ebook on the Patriots playbook and a full ebook on the Packers playbook as well. So if you're looking to take your game to the next level, I think the Patreon is a great place to get better at the game. So what we're going to do to set this play up is we are going to drag our tight end. We're going to re-angle route the running back. That's really important. Um, if you don't have a high route master, you don't have to, uh, but I do like to re-angle that running back. If I can, it's going to be a better man beater for you. Then we're going to motion the middle trips receiver to the trip side. It's going to kind of create a little hidden motion within trip side in. And then we're going to either leave the curl route or put that outside receiver on a comeback route. Now, our first read on this play is going to be the tight end. Then we're going to look to the running back. If both of those routes are covered, then generally the post route is going to be wide open over the middle of the field. Now, I did want to talk about this curl route um, as it is a really good route. I do also like the, the uh, comeback route, but let's touch on the curl route real quick. When he stops against man coverage this year, really consistent is going to be able to beat uh, man coverage. So if you want to be a little bit more consistent against man I like the curl. If you want to be a little bit more consistent against zone, then, for example, like an outside third or something on that sideline, then you want to utilize a comeback route. What you're going to notice from this comeback route, when he cuts, you're going to get a little bit more space against zone coverage, both from the deep defender and the underneath defender as well. So a couple different things are going to have to do to stop this. Typically, maybe running like a cloud over there, and then, you know, they're going to have to have a deep half over the top to try to help stop the the streak, a couple different things they can do. But now we're going to be able to really work this tight end and this running back Texas pattern over the middle of the field. Very easy ways. Uh, both of these routes beat man coverage pretty consistently. So I like to use those uh, on this play. And then let's talk about zone coverage briefly. So let's say you guess wrong and it is a zone coverage. One of the best routes in the entire game this year against zone is this post route, especially if you pair this with a clear out streak. The reason being is because the clear out streak is going to do a really good job of basically attacking the zone coverage, whether it be cover three, whether it be cover two, whether it be cover four, um, it doesn't really matter. And I'll show you again here, you'll see, boom, there's that uh, deep post, really good and really consistent uh, for being able to attack the zone coverage. Now, the other thing that you're able to do, let's talk about cover two and specifically more like a double Mabel style cover two. The beauty of this post route is this post route gets a lot of depth against cover two. And also with the with just the way uh, this is going to run in general, the mid read actually is going to match this, which is actually kind of crazy. But you see he's going to get over the top of a 30 yard cloud flat, for example. So even if they back these guys up, this guy should be able to consistently uh, be able to get over the top of a 30 yard cloud, which will show that. And then what this is gonna do, it's gonna force them to user the post, which is gonna take their user out of the middle of the field. And then we're gonna be able to hit our uh, running back Texas pattern. But as you can see right here, just absolute laser on that sideline, really good route to be able to get over 30 yard clouds. And then if they, if they do decide to basically take their user out of the middle of the field, then what you're going to be able to do is you're going to be able to basically check it down to your running back angle route over the middle or your drag. So um, this play just really loaded being able to attack multiple defensive coverages. Thanks for watching the video to get the rest of this ebook. Make sure you join the Patreon. 10 bucks will get you access to everything in the Patreon. 